So, this just fucking hilarious. You guys are gonna love this. I went to the dentist today. <laughs> okay, I went to the dentist today. Um, actually, it wasn't a dentist. It's a community college, right down the street. They advertise, you know, twenty dollars teeth cleaned and X-rays, right? I haven't been to the dentist for like five fucking years, so I'm like, okay, you know, I got no fucking money, so. You know, I go to the dentist, or the actually I go to the community college, and they're actually not dentists, they're patients. You know, there's one dentist on site, and there's like 20 patients, or I'm sorry, students running around. It's a training thing, you know, and that's why they only do teeth cleaning. Anyway, I get there, and <laughs> there's this, oh, beautiful ladies, beautiful women there. I gotta get the fuck off YouTube and get out more often, because these girls are smoking. The two that were working on me, one was from the Ukraine. Not the UK, but the Ukraine. I kind of understand a word she fucking said, man, but it didn't matter because she was so fucking beautiful. I was just happy to be there. And the other one was a smoking Japanese woman, all right? Both probably early 20s. Anyway, you know, I, I, I lay down in the chair and um, they took my blood pressure. They asked me some questions. And the UK, the I'm sorry, the Ukraine woman, her accent was so heavy, I couldn't understand a word she was fucking saying. But I didn't fucking give a shit. I mean, I was just, you know, staring at her the whole time. Creeping her out, probably. And, uh, anyway, she takes my blood pressure and says, Oh, it's 130 over 120. And I'm like, that's a little fucking high, you know. I don't have high blood pressure. And, uh, so they retake it again with a different machine the the Asian one does. And it's normal. It was like 120 over 80 or something like that. But anyway... They're whispering back and forth, right? I don't know what the fuck they're saying, you know? I'm just, uh, oogling them. They whisper back and forth. Alright. They whisper back and forth, um, about the blood pressure, and all of a sudden the instructor, which is like a real dentist, comes over and says, Sir, uh, how much have you had to drink today? I'm like, mm, nothing. And she's like, Sir, how much do you have to drink today? I'm like, uh, ma'am, nothing. And she's like, sir, you smell like alcohol. We cannot continue this examination for liability reasons because I think you're intoxicated. I was like, ma'am, I haven't anything to drink for 10 fucking hours. I got up, I showered, I shit, I drank some coffee. I am not fucking drunk. She's like, sir. Are you currently in a uh, alcohol recovery program? I'm like, what kind of question is that? I just want my fucking teeth cleaned. Sir, uh, who's your primary care physician? I'm like, ma'am, I just came here to get my teeth cleaned. Uh, she's like, sir, how much do you have a drink today? I'm like, ma'am, nothing. It's been 10 hours since I last had a beer. Yes, I drank heavily last night, but it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm here to get my teeth cleaned. I am not drunk whatsoever. So, like, sir, how much do you drink on a daily basis? I was like, uh, meh, maybe a six pack of beer. She's like, sir, how much do you really drink on a daily basis? I'm like, okay, fuck you, 12 pack of beer. She's like, sir, uh, we cannot continue this examination because I think you are still under the influence of alcohol. I was like, I just thought I was coming to get my teeth cleaned. I didn't know this was a fucking intervention. Sir, well, let's reschedule you for a day when you haven't been drinking. I'm like, ma'am, I have not been fucking drinking. Will you please just clean my teeth so I can get the fuck out of here? Sir, how about next Friday at 8 o'clock in the morning? Is that early? Is that too early for you? Ma'am, that will work fine. And I was, <laughs> she asked me again, are, are, are you currently in a recovery program? I'm like, no. Why are you? Sir? Uh, <laughs> this went back and forth like this for a little bit. And I asked her, I said, how much do you drink on a daily basis? Uh, sir, I, I have about two or three glasses of wine a week. I'm like, oh. Well, I have two or three bottles of wine a day. Anyway, I didn't say that. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> so, my day was fucked. Went all the way down there for fucking nothing. It was hilarious, though. It was kind of embarrassing because 
I had these beautiful women, man. One from the Ukraine, wherever the fuck that is. I think that's somewhere around Russia. Ah, dead sexy. And this Japanese woman. And then they bust out the instructor because it smelled like beer. And I know what it was. I mean, I had shit showered and shaved. Well, not shaved, but I, I know what it was. I spilt beer on my jacket. This jacket. I spilt beer on my jacket, and I... That's my jacket smells like beer, not me. All right, like I said, I had showered, I had brushed my teeth, I had coffee, I had breakfast, and then I brushed my teeth again. I don't know. Cool experience, though. And I could get my hair cut there. Yeah, it's like that. Yeah, they're all students. That's why it's all fucked up looking. Yeah, but it's only five bucks. 